what do you see as the benefit of, of including the, the photobiomodulation in the training? So the photobiomodulation does a couple of different things. One, one is stimulating at, at certain frequencies, right? So it's helping these cells, these neurons actually fire at the frequency we want them to fire at. But it's also providing energy for that too. What happens in the brain is the brain will get to a certain threshold where it's not able to utilize very efficiently its, its energy, its ATP and things like that, mitochondria. And what happens is by introducing this photobiomodulation actually helps blood flow, it helps oxygen levels, it help, helps the energy transfer mechanisms, and it makes a big difference in keeping going with training. It, it's like boosts of energy and uh, boosts of neuromodulation. It, it gives the kind of pendulum swing for the neurons to follow, and it really mm -hmm. helps. And, and what's unique about the transcranial photobiomodulation boost mode that Sensei uses is like Drew has mentioned already, is that it's adaptive to you. And so that means that we'll adapt, we'll, um, the, the pulse will adapt the duration, you know, and we're reading, we're using the electrodes to look at your brain's physiological response. Part of this <laughs> is, is more, more is not necessarily better in this realm. You want to yes. do it to, because if you stimulate too much, it, it creates a, a, um, kind of like a feedback loop in the brain where it actually pushes back. So you want to do it appropriately. And you exactly. don't want to do it too little either where it doesn't give any response. So find your sweet and we, spot. And, and, and we actually started um, with no intention of doing adaptive boost. Our, our initial sort of testing was on just sort of one size fits all boost. Um, and, and we actually, as we were testing and, and looking at the data coming off of it, um, saw, you know, very inconsistent results from that um, from person to person. And so, um, so we actually, you know, worked really hard and, and iterated a whole bunch to, to build out an adaptive um, sort of boost mode that um, does personalize within uh, within the session and um, have seen really fantastic results from that. 